Hey and welcome. Have you heard that CO2 is a greenhouse gas and that it's causing global warming? Well, yes, that's definitely true. And the great question is really how much CO2 is in the air and um, it can be measured. Yeah, that's for good. That's good news. We can just measure it. Uh, how much is there in the air and how much is it really coming from human sources? How much is like our fault? Well, I can, you know, we can go to our website and we have some diagrams there. We are reworking the website, but like, hey, let's have a look at this diagram here. Yeah. So on this diagram, you see that um, since the 1960s, in the 1960s, we had like 320 or so parts per million CO2. And that was about 320, yeah? that was like what the CO2 in the atmosphere has been, the maximum for the last like 800,000 to 1 million years. It was never higher than 320. And we could measure that, so there's like ways to find that out. And um, well, that was like the highest ever in the history before we humans actually changed the planet <clears throat> was 320. So. Now look at this curve. That was 320 in the 1960s and there we had like already like decades and no, almost a century of uh, industrialization and humans were producing more and more CO2 and we were taking oil, gas and coal from the ground and burning it. So, and now you see what is happening here. We have a curve and you see that this curve is going up. You can also check this out, just Google it. You know, CO2 concentration in the air, you know, find something from NASA and so on. Yeah, it's really, um, it's just a diagram we made a little bit to easier see this curve. You see this? That was like the green part and it's going up all the time. That is the problem. And all, lot, like lots and lots of people talk about, hey, we are doing, you know, something against climate. And no, the bottom line is, the bottom line is the CO2 concentration in the air. This is what really is out there. It can be measured. And it's now already about 425. And these levels haven't been seen for like 10 million years or so. The atmosphere and the planet was like completely different from today. So we are, cha we are making a very, very dramatic change here to the world's atmosphere. Look it up, Google it, CO2 concentration in the air, and then you see, hey, we are not at nowhere are we near a path to turn something around. We have to do this, we have to turn climate change around. Thank you very much for watching. Please follow the channel.